You might see the trade behind me and might be thinking, what the heck are you doing to the Lakers? Well, I'm trading Russell Westbrook. Um, uh, Believe it or not, I recorded this video already and uh, it was a success, but now we got to do it over because my game capture did not capture. So a little mad, a little mad. Not, not going to be, not going to be, uh, not going to lie, but we're going to go ahead, do this over. Like the video for me, beat up that YouTube algorithm. Uh, comment down below as well. Like it really does help the channel if you guys, if you guys didn't know. Um. The more likes and the more interaction that a channel gets, the higher it gets shot up, the more people see the video, stuff like that. Make sure to do that for me. Deny the vision.com to get yourself your hoodie needs. Um, three goats up there. Go choose yours. Go represent yours. Deny the vision.com. But let's get to it. Russell Westbrook, the Lakers in shambles. Not a contending team in my eyes. LeBron James isn't getting any younger uh anthony davis might have just got injured and might be kind of serious i really hope not but also has been injury prone in his career but besides that some crazy regression that we're seeing from him um he's just out there getting bullied and he's just not playing well in 2k we really don't have to uh, care about anthony davis he's gonna be good regardless he's gonna be a 20 and 10 type of guy but russell westbrook we're going to go ahead and trade him immediately. This is the exact same trade I did in the first time around when I did this. So we're going to go ahead and do it again. I believe they wanted a first rounder last time and they didn't want that second. But we're getting, they're getting Nick Richards, I guess, a 23 year old. If we could trade him. I don't want him. Y'all can get a first instead. Let's see if they just want a first. Uh, they want a 2023 20, pick. They want Trevor Reza. They want to give me that. Can I just offer seconds? I'm going to see if I can finesse it because I don't, really don't want. I really don't want Nick. I don't need Nick. I could throw in seconds and we'll see if it is enough. They want the first rounder. They give us a second rounder back. Sure. I just don't want the player swaps. This trade will go through. What I did for this was go to the roster, change some, I believe, positions. Terry ended up being my starting point guard. He goes up at the point guard spot. I ended up changing, I believe, PJ Washington to power forward, secondary position center. And then there was one more trade that I made that I guess made. Now, why would you be? Um, also, you might wonder why I traded him to the Hornets. Why Russell Westbrook to the Hornets? He was kind of rumored there when he was with the Rockets. Uh, the Hornets were interested in getting him. I don't know if they would be at all now. Probably not. But uh, why not? You know, he's got that 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 dog mentality that Jordan probably loves and would love to have in his locker room. Um, but who knows? Who knows? Does it make sense? Probably not. And then also, why why Gordon Hayward? Why Terry? I mean, I mean, we need a guard back to run our guard position. Gordon Hayward, I could play from shooting guard to small uh, to power forward if I wanted to. And we just saw him erupt for 41 points. He still has game in him. He still has game in him. Yes, his contract isn't. We don't like that, but it's fine. It's fine, and it's good enough. We also get a young P.J. Washington who uh, uh, improves into the 80s to help us win a championship. Now, we go ahead and ask for uh, the Pacers. The Pacers, we need a shooting guard, I think, to fill out the roster, and that is what I did last time. Who did I trade away, though? All right, I gave him Taylor Horn Tucker because why not? He doesn't shoot well in 2K, at least not this first season, maybe not the second season uh, as well. Um, I believe I had to add Kendrick Nunn. I don't remember because we had to make the money match up. So I think I did. Yes, I believe I did. I believe I did. I brought in Brad. Have to throw in Kendrick Nunn. Absolutely fine with it. Um, And then we got O'Shea, who O'Shea ended up being a bench piece in the second season. They don't like it. We offer seconds. We might offer a, yeah, we might offer a first, but I think seconds was enough before. Is it enough now? Yes, it is. A bunch of seconds. Our team is rounded out. One more move to make. One more move to make. I believe I have to create a caps. I mean, not a caps. I have to create a roster spot. You know exactly what we're going to do. We do not need Brad Wanamaker. He is gone. We go into free agency. And I mean, the guy that just got it a 10, 10 day contract or a hardship contract because everybody's entering the protocols. Is the league going to shut it down for a couple weeks to get it under control? I don't know. But yes, Isaiah Thomas, IT, staying with the Lakers for us, at least in this rebuild for this first season. And now this completely revamped Laker team, Terry, Karis LeVert, Gordon Hayward, LeBron James, Anthony Davis, Carmelo Anthony, Dwight Howard, PJ Washington, and Isaiah Thomas off my bench. Now, in the, current, the other rebuild, I didn't do all these trades right away. I didn't sign Isaiah Thomas right away. It was more so I did that Hornets trade. 
then we ended up being like first then we found a fourth then we found a sixth then i had to revamp again i got karis lavert to the squad anthony davis was mad because we were losing um and then he ended up being happy again because we ended up being number one in the conference we'll see if that happens once more um but this time having lavert from the start having isaiah thomas off the bench from the start the bench looks solid i have no problem with this bench and of course the very last thing that we got to do is system proficiency um i believe ooh, pace space is looking decent um but i ran seven i ran seven because seven was the best alongside balance we're running seven seconds we finished at with a top like six offense and then a top defense as well i don't think it was the greatest but it was solid enough simulate the regular season i'll see if i finish number one once again or if 2k scams me this time around but we're starting with the squad from the beginning it's not looking too great it's not looking too great it looked great before but we'll see i'm gonna rock with it if it doesn't work i make more moves i believe in this team as a championship squad because i literally saw them win a championship just my freaking game wasn't recording finished third not first still have a chance of a championship so i'll take it i guess um it just sucks because literally i recorded it and it was perfection um if i remember a team almost came back 3-1 against us i think in the second round of the yeah second round of the playoffs and then we went to the finals and i believe we came back against the 76ers from a 3-0 we went, came back from a 3-0. That's why I was like, so LeBron has come back from a 3-1, and now he's come back from a 3-0. It was perfect. Anyway, Giannis MVP, Cade Cunningham, Rookie of the Year, Six Man, Andre Drummond, Giannis Defensive Player, Most Improved Drew, Willie Green, Coach of the Year, Executive of the Year, Dylan Shaw. We finished third. I hate it here. Um, I just wasn't recording, and I hope it's recording now or I'm going to die. LeBron James it makes an All-NBA third team, and I believe they also make defensive teams. Two Bucks, two Lakers. 176er player stat check last time it was lebron james it is lebron james again uh the lowest scoring since his rookie season i'm pretty sure anthony davis 18 12 board 16 for karis lavert 14 for terry 12 for isaiah thomas who ended up being like my sixth man 12 for gordon hayward 8 for carmelo anthony dwight howard 7 and 8 like a double double machine if you got the minutes pj washington decent as well usually a sniper not this time 34 percent it's fine it's fine what does that rank us along these other nba teams so we're behind the pelicans grizzlies lakers it, i mean what <laughs> we are the lakers but when it was when it wasn't recording um the we were the number one team in the western conference and the third power rank because two teams were ahead of us in the eastern conference it was the bucks and the 76ers or the Celtics. no it was the celtics and the 76ers and i was hoping for a celtics final We'll see what happens this time. Our offense doesn't is not not even nearly as close as it was last time. What changed? What could have changed? I don't know. But our defense is number two, which I think it was like down here somewhere. Um, so I guess it's better than I get. Okay, cool. Differential six point nine. And the rebuild that didn't record. Um, we did versus the Golden State Warriors, but they were the playing team, so they were quite a bit uh, worse, I guess. Um, we did four one them in that, so. Oh, no, please stop. Please stop. Why does that happen? <laughs> Either way, let's get past a seven seed. I mean, they're a seven seed. Yes, they beat a what? Uh, a two seed, which is kind of scary in itself. But like, come on, seven seed for a reason. They have Donovan Mitchell. If Donovan Mitchell gets slowed down just a little bit, like we should have a chance, right? A big chance. Seven games. Now we're probably, ooh, do it, make Portland, make it Portland, make it Portland. This is the most realistic basketball game out there, and for some reason, the Pelicans always make it to the conference finals or the finals, but not this time. What the heck? <laughs> what just happened? Ooh, that's how it should, no, they should technically not be in the playoffs, but okay, um, if we versus the, oh, we don't. Okay, so two things changed this time around. Last time, we were the number one seed. We 4-1 the Golden State Warriors. I think it was Portland who we went up against, and then it was the Jazz, and then we versus Philadelphia. But I'm not going to complain. We're in the finals again. I don't know if we're winning against this team because it's super well-rounded out. Like, guys that could shoot from three, Bobby Portis. Giannis' his shot is improving. Chris Middleton, a bucket. Dante, a defensive three and D guy. Drew Holiday, same thing. Uh, solid, solid point guard. One of the best hands, one of the best defender in the game. 
And then they add some nice pieces to their bench. Ugh. Ah, I tried my best. I don't know if this is going to work. Why what? Why was that so easy? Why do we go seven against Golden State and Utah, and then we four zero Zion, and we four one Giannis? Literally the ones in the game that are like insane. A lot with with Luca as well. If it was Luca, that would have been like I, I low key got goosebumps right now <laughs> with how easy that was. I don't know why it was that easy. Twenty four ten and eight. Uh, we're going to run it back like I tried running it back in the other video. Hopefully this time it turns out better because last time we didn't win. This time we'll see what I can do to make them win. Change. We get a second chance at it, I guess. I don't want to blow up my team. I don't want to blow up this championship roster. We literally destroyed Zion and we destroyed Giannis. How? No idea. But it worked. It worked again. And I'm happy it worked again. This time, I'm going to try to make it work two times in a row. Get it back-to-back -back championship. Right now, technically, the Lakers would be the winningest championship. I'm pretty sure the Celtics and the Lakers are tied in real life. Lakers now would be one up, and now we're going to go two up if we can. Try to finesse for Kevin Porter Jr. They want Ricky Rubio. They want to give me Drew. That's honestly not horrible. Not horrible. Going to give him second rounders and probably a first. Going to keep Rubio for now, and I'm going to trade him. Now, Whiteside signed him in free agency literally when the season started. Rubio in the last day of free agency, um, you know, just brought him into the team and hope for the best um we're gonna swap the pelicans pick see if they want that first rounder they do not we'll give them second rounders how did the spurs even end up with kevin porter jr but i know kevin porter is an absolute bucket off the bench um so he's gonna be sick he's gonna be sick pj staying kevin porter now here rubio another guy that we can make a trade with and we still have first rounders alongside that what do we even need off the bench i guess we could use a point guard unless we run kevin porter at point yeah kevin porter is gonna be point guard okay Shooting guard, small forward is what we need. Shooting guard, small forward. O'Shea, I'm okay with being my ninth man. Shooting guard, small forward, and my Bulls are literally giving me both. Uh, Otto Porter returned to the Bulls, I guess. Io is at the shooting guard position. He didn't even get any minutes. Um, they get a first rounder, essentially, and Ricky Rubio. Don't know what their thoughts are there. Um, but I'm pretty sure Otto Porter Jr. improves at the small forward position. So that's what we're going to switch him to. Or he just stays the same. Okay, perfect. That's still fine. Now, this is a lot different than what I had in my last rebuild when it didn't record. Sorry, I keep bringing that up. I, it got me mad, okay? It got me mad. But I'm fine now because we won again. We won again season one. Don't know how we destroyed Zion and Giannis back to back series don't know how honestly now is this team still enough to come out of the western conference we were third last season what will we finish this season the bench is looking decent pj kevin porter Otto porter uh and io now i don't think rebounding wise our bench is the greatest but we'll see but we'll see if it's enough especially kevin because kevin's a monster off the bench pj's decent we'll see if he's a sniper um and we'll see if the, this brings us enough wins to compete once again because i believe hayward declined lebron declined not much but still it's they declined seven seconds still looks great you guys know i like seven seconds if he's a defensive coach even better defense plus a fast offense i'll take it year two this team does look different than the one that i made last season uh, i mean not last season last rebuild and we're actually playing a lot better than what we did um because i think so in the rebuild that didn't end up getting recorded we were first in the western conference in the first season and then i think we finished fourth fourth or third and this time it might be flipped which is honestly kind of creepy in the same way because <laughs> <laughs> kind of the same but different we'll see if we do finish first we finished second i kind of scared of whoever finished first it might be zion and the pelicans because i saw like the end of january start of february we had nothing but wins and we were still second so don't know what they're doing out there in new orleans i'm guessing it is new orleans Giannis mvp rookie of the year uh paolo clint is six man with the wolves anthony davis defensive player they okay I, d I don't really see that, but I'll take it. 12 rebounds, 2.3 blocks. We must have the number one defense, um, even though our power rank is fourth. Willie Green, 64. Nice. LeBron, no All-NBA team. What happened to LeBron? What happened to LeBron? And, of course, Anthony Davis makes All-NBA third team and makes a defensive first team. 
Whoa. Where's LeBron? New Orleans, like I said, number one. Big surprise? Not really. LeBron 21, 7 and 7 doesn't make an all NBA team. What is that? Well, he should have. Anyways, defensive player for Anthony Davis is kind of surprising to me. 16 for Lavert, 14 for Terry, 11 for Gordon Hayward, 11 off the bench for Kevin Porter. Of course, he's beasting. He's beasting. 18 and 7 per 36. We like that. 10.5 for PJ off the bench. That's really good, too, actually. 10 and 6. Shooting 39% from three, a sniper. Like I said, he would become Otto Porter, seven and four off the bench. Does a little bit of everything. Could shoot the ball well. Could play small forward, power forward. I like this team. I like this team. We're second. And they have a young IO to build around. They have a what? 24-year-old PJ Washington to build around. A 22-year-old Kevin Porter to build around. They would essentially not have nothing, which is what they kind of have right now. A lot of old players whole lot of nothing, no real drafts, picks, and no cap space because it's all tied up in three players. So the Pelicans and the Bucks look like the elite teams, but we spanked them last season somehow. So if we verse them or if we get to verse them, I mean, do we have a chance? Do we have a chance? We're 11th. I think our offense is a little bit better this time around. Our defense, number one, differential still seven, which I think was the same as last season we shall see who we're up against first sacramento please be an easy one harrison barnes but he healed like they're kind of undersized in a way so i'll rebound them i'll rebound them what is that what is that 2k how do you go back and forth like that 2k you go from me being elite, absolutely destroying Zion and uh, uh, Giannis to going seven against Sacramento. Minnesota. Oh, wait. That's what the heck. Minnesota. What do they? Kendrick Nunn, Anthony Edwards, Michael Porter Jr. Where did he come from? No, seriously. Who did they trade? <laughs> who did they trade? I mean, I'm guessing it was D'Angelo Russell, but what the heck? They add Carmelo Anthony. The defense is non-existent. Carl Anthony Towns has been stepping it up on defense, though. So, But technically non-existent. Michael Porter Jr., Carmelo Anthony. Like, come on. Uh, Capella off the bench. They got some length off the bench. That's a weird-looking team. Weird. Okay. Like, I would love a rematch. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. We're up against... Not New Orleans. <laughs> Not New Orleans, not the number one team, and we wouldn't even have to go up against the number one team. Luck is on our side. Of course, Luka Doncic can beat anybody. Um, they have Kevin Love and Kristaps. I don't know how the rebounding would be. Seven rebounds. Seven rebounds? Kyle Anderson. Uh, I, uh, I really don't like this. I don't like the rebounding. Would that not be a... Why do we keep losing game one? <laughs> why? I mean, I guess if we spank them after game one... Okay, we're not. We're not, but... Oh. Oh, no, that's where the video ends. Oh, Luka Doncic, Luka Doncic being Luka Doncic. I hate these, I hate three players. Well, not uh, two, especially. Luka Doncic and Zion Williamson in 2K are just dumb. They're just dumb. I hate them. I hate going up against them. Anytime I go up against them, I feel like I could lose at any moment. And that's annoying. We clearly do lose. Damn, we could have gone back to back. It doesn't happen in this one as well. Mavericks versus Hawks. Uh, last season, last rebuild, the one that didn't record, uh, New Orleans did get to the finals, and I was like, New Orleans is going to win it. And then, big surprise. I'm going to go with the Mavericks. I don't know who the Hawks have, though. Gary Payton, DeAndre Hunter, John Con I'm still going to go with the Mavericks. I mean, I mean, <laughs> you have to pick Zion or Luka in 2K. You'll be right a lot of times. You'll be, oh my God. God, 44, 7, and 12 assists with two steals in the finals, shooting 54% from three. That's going to be it for me. We do get the championship in season one again. That's all that I wanted to, and I kind of left them in a better spot than what I left the other rebuild that didn't record. Um, so, yeah, I left them in a really solid spot considering the age that a lot of these guys are 23 year old kevin porter was that a realistic trade no but he's also ended up in san antonio somehow io who knows i mean if i'm the bulls i'm looking for trades around kobe white if i'm being honest because io looking nice 
Uh, they still have Caruso. They still have Zach Levine. They still have guards. We need maybe a power forward or something. Who knows? AK is probably taking care of all that stuff. You know what I'm saying? PJ Washington out here, 24 years old. Um, what else? 25, O'Shea. Karis LeVert, only 28. Terry, only 29. So they still have basketball to play. Anthony Davis, 30. Hopefully he turns it around. Otto Porter, only 30. The oldest, 38 LeBron. And then beside, besides Gordon Hayward and, and LeBron James, like this team still has quite a bit of basketball to play. How bright would their future be? No idea. Probably not the brightest. But I'll consider it a success once again because I won season one. Um, I was so mad after my other one didn't record. I'm hoping this one's recording. Like it said it was recording like this one is. But you never freaking know. For some reason, it didn't work. Um, this time, please work. One LeBron, another championship. Fix the Lakers up in year one. Hopefully not too unrealistic. Signing Isaiah Thomas, clearly not unrealistic. Trading Westbrook, it all depends where. It all depends where. I really like the Hornets trade because it brought us more depth. It literally got us three players in Terry, PJ Washington, Gordon Hayward. I, we can't, you can't be mad at that. Um, drop a like, beat up that YouTube algorithm for me. Like I, like I say, it really does help the channel. Um, it, it's, it helps other people see the channel. Comment what you'd like to see. Like the video. If you're, you're new, subscribe. DenyTheVision.com. Go check out the hoodies. And as always, guys, thanks for watching. Thank you.